Peter pointed out, um, there have been, I think, two things that have been very clear since the uh, uh, beginning of this discussion. And one is that the Democrats are unwilling to negotiate on the next coronavirus uh, relief bill unless, unless Republicans concede to trillions of dollars of new spending, unpaid for, borrowed spending, dollars that we put on the debt and hand to our children and grandchildren. The other reality is that, uh, is that Republicans have uh, desired to work, been committed to working toward a solution that is targeted, that is fiscally responsible, and that is rooted in reality. Uh, the Democrat proposal meets none of those criteria. Uh, I think we all know that uh, the Democrats, as the leader pointed out, have uh, decided that it's in their best interest to uh, try and use this as a political issue and have been, been unwilling to come to the table uh, to negotiate uh, with Republicans on something that actually could get passed, could get signed into law, that is a realistic proposal. And essentially what they're saying is that we would rather have zero, zero dollars for the American people than work with the Republicans on a targeted, fiscally responsible bill that is realistic. And so uh, that's where we are today, but tomorrow um, we have put forward and advanced a proposal that, as the leader pointed out, addresses the most urgent concerns that people have out there, uh, is focused on getting people back to work, uh, creating those jobs again, focused on helping parents with child care, focused on getting kids back to school, supporting our teachers and our administrators and students and parents who are trying to get kids back to school safely and also focused on the health care crisis in front of us by putting additional funding into testing and therapeutics and vaccines and all the things that in the end are going to help defeat this virus. Uh, that's what this Republican proposal is focused on. Um, right now the Democrats are saying they're going to vote against even proceeding to it, even getting on the bill, so they're going to block it. Uh, and I think uh, uh, notwithstanding their um, assertions to the contrary, tomorrow it's going to be very clear going to be very clear to everybody uh, who is standing in the way of getting a bill across the finish line that would provide meaningful and needed assistance uh, to the American people.